So hello, this is Paul Bergen from Mars Hill Blog, which you can find at www.paulbergin.blogspot.co.uk uh, Occasionally, it's meant to be once a week, but obviously there's been some delay on that, not at least in the run-up to Christmas. But I tend to do an album review. And the one I've had for some weeks is Paul McCartney's Egypt Station. It's it's a good album. I am a bit surprised the packaging. It it does make it slightly difficult to um stock uh store where if you're slightly in these tend to slightly in like everything in alphabetical order and your albums and books and stuff. Uh, autumn order. But it is um McCartney really disappoints. I think even the stuff that's in inverted commas bad is better than a lot of people's stuff and um what I've heard of the album so far is good. It, it, some of it is pure McCartney stuff. Uh for you I find a bit smug to be honest. Um but come on to me it's good. Who the ones I particularly like are Who Cares? Um Back in Brazil's good. But, Who Cares is good, and um, I Don't Know, which is, is perhaps a bit whimsical. But there is this, he hasn't lost his touch. Um, he's at a time in his life when many of his contemporaries have long retired or have done a studio album for so long. He still does these, I mean, every four or five years, granted. But he still brings them out. They're still good. And they still sell. But not only that, they, the quality is there. Occasionally he'll do an album which isn't as good as, the say, the previous one. I would still argue that Chaos and Creation in the Backyard is still his latest best album. That's not to say the ones he's done since aren't good. But... They, they, I just don't think they're as good as Chaos and Creation in the Backyard. But these are good in, in their own merit. Um, and they, they, they do, they're far better than a lot of the work that some people do. So yeah, it's, it's, it's worth, it's, you know, if you're Mac even if you're not a McCartney fan, I would buy it. It's, you know, he's done better stuff, but it is still, it's worthwhile to buy. It's worthwhile to listen to. It is, it, McCartney is a genius, and he, you know, even, you know, some of the, and there are some outstanding tracks. As I said, I particularly like Who Cares, and I, I Don't Know, and um, Back in Brazil. So, yeah, yeah, do go for it. And I, I love the fact it's a bit of a concept album. I'd love to see McCartney do a full-blown concept album at some point. Um, but, you know, that's up to him. Cheers.